so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Mika! Hi, it's me, Mika. And today we are at O2B Kids in Orlando, Florida. I'm so excited to be here because I love science and I get to do a science experiment right here. Will you do one with me? Awesome, let's see how we can get started. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mika. Hi Mika, I'm Trudy and welcome to Oda Kids New Learning Playground. Hi Trudy, nice to meet you. Well, nice to meet you. So I heard that I could do a science experiment here and make elephant toothpaste. We love elephant toothpaste and we've actually put together a scavenger hunt for you. What, that sounds so fun. Will you go on a scavenger hunt with me? <laughs> cool, so how do I start? You're all checked in and ready to go. Oh. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Check it out. We're at the science lab. For this science experiment, we need to find six items in our scavenger hunt. We need to find hydrogen peroxide, safety goggles, dish soap, food coloring, measuring cups, and yeast. <laughs> okay, can you help me look for these items? Great, let's go. Whoa. Mind gym. Whoa, this must be a room for your mind. <laughs> wow, this is so cool. I recognize some numbers here. Will you count with me? <laughs> okay, we have one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, that's so fun. Oh, okay, I don't see any items yet for our science experiment. Hmm. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's kind of like a musical instrument. <laughs> See all these different colors? Oh, look, there's little items in here that you can find. Oh, looks like a balloon and a little fuzzy ball. Ooh, <laughs> this is fun. Cool. <gasps> Hydrogen peroxide. We found our first item for our science experiment. Hydrogen peroxide can help heal a cut but you do not want to get this in your eyes. So we need to find safety goggles. Okay, good job. We have our first item. Check it out. A word find. So this big puzzle has a bunch of words in it, but they throw other letters in it to mix it all up. So it's kind of hard to see the words. See if you can find any words in here. You have to look really close. Oh, I found one. <laughs> Look, P-E-A-R, pear. Ooh, that's a really yummy fruit. Any other words that can maybe give us a clue to the things that we're looking for? Oh, what about this word? Safety, safety, like safety goggles? Maybe there are safety goggles around here. Oh, look, there's some letters down here. <gasps> Do you know what letter this is? <laughs> it's the letter M for Mika. And it's one of my favorite colors. The color yellow. <laughs> <gasps> we did it. We found safety goggles. Safety goggles are really important when you do experiments because they protect your eyeballs. <laughs> All right, two items down, four to go. Safety goggles and hydrogen peroxide. All right, let's keep looking. <gasps> oh, whoa, it's like a grocery store or a market in here. <gasps> Look at all of this play food. Oh, cool. It looks like it's organized by color. I see green and orange and yellow. Ooh, what is in here? A cucumber slice. I love cucumbers. Oh, and 
a green apple. That's a nice healthy fruit. And one of my favorite vegetables, broccoli. <laughs> Ooh, and a tomato slice. These are all really healthy foods. Yeah, fruit and vegetables, they have nutrients and vitamins in there. So they're what I like to call an all the time food. They help you grow. Ooh, what's this? Some pizza. Mmm. <laughs> hey, let's see if we can find anything that we need for our science experiment. Whoa! This is like a little restaurant or a diner. Ooh, don't mind if I do. Put a little ketchup on here. Mmm. <laughs> Pretty tasty. See if there's anything in here. <gasps> I found yeast. We need yeast in our science experiment. If you add warm water to yeast, it helps things rise. In fact, you need yeast to make bread. That's right. Hey, we are doing a great job on the scavenger hunt. Let's put this with our other things and then we can keep looking for more items for our experiment. <laughs> Good job. Let's keep looking. <sighs> okay, let's keep looking for more items for our science experiment. Whoa, there's a lot of fun things in here. <gasps> Come over here. <gasps> oh, look at these big blocks. Huh. Let's see, what can I make here? Okay. Hmm. Huh, feels pretty sturdy. It could be a new chair. <laughs> put this on it and this, or it could be a throne. Queen Mika. <laughs> oh, I still don't see anything for our science experiment. Hmm. Maybe there's something over here. Hey, a hula hoop. Check it out. Do you know what shape this is? <laughs> That's right. It's a circle. And it's the color green. Let's see if I can hula hoop. <laughs> Let me try again. Ready, set, hula hoop, hula hoop. Oh, that was a little better. Look, you can also put it on your arm like a giant bracelet and swing, 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 swing. <laughs> but you know what? This is not something that we need for our science experiment. Fun though. Hmm. Oh, this is a really cool game. Look, you have a spinner, and it tells you where to put your body on the dots. Left, foot, yellow, see? Left, foot, yellow. Hmm. Left, foot, yellow. Let's see if I can do one more turn on here. Whoop. This is left hand green. Whoa, need to try not to fall down. <gasps> I might fall down soon. <laughs> That's okay. All right. Mm. Come over here. <gasps> Whoa, do you know what this is? It's a bottom of a slide. Should I go down the slide? Okay. Oh. Wow, it looks like it's really high up. I wonder if there's anything at the top that we can use for our science experiment. I can't wait to make elephant toothpaste. <laughs> it says socks only. That means I need to take my shoes off. All right, let's, oh, they go in these copies over here. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go to the top and see if I can find something for our experiment. See you at the bottom. Oh, <laughs> hi. <gasps> I 
think I see something for our experiment. I'll see you soon. Woo! <laughs> Look what I found! Dish soap. We definitely need this for our experiment. <laughs> I'm so excited. Thanks for your help. All right, I'm gonna grab my shoes and our other items for our experiment and we can keep looking. We have two more to find. Come on. Hello. <laughs> Let's keep looking. <gasps> cool clock. <laughs> Whoa, look over here. It says A R T. Art. <laughs> this is an art space. <gasps> cool. Look at this big piece of paper. Oh, I could color something on here. Ooh, look at all of these markers. I'm gonna choose purple because it's one of my favorite colors. <laughs> all right, let's see. What should I draw? Ooh, I know. See if you can guess. It's a science flask. You can use this in a science experiment, <laughs> but it kind of looks like something else. What do you think? Okay, I'll give you a hint. Do you know now? <laughs> it's two eyes and a nose. <laughs> what else does it need? Oh, right, a mouth. Give it a big mouth. Big smile. Hello. <laughs> oh, there's crayons too. Maybe I could put something else on here and choose a different color. Let's see. Um, oh, I found the food coloring. Look. <laughs> oh, and it's my two favorite colors, purple and yellow. We're getting closer and closer to finding everything we need for our science experiment. Oh, one more item to find. Come on. Whoa. <laughs> hey, look at this. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> cool bee. Wow, it looks like this bee's measuring something. <laughs> hey, Mr. Bee, I like your style. Purple and yellow, two of my favorite colors. <laughs> hey, it looks like we even have the same kind of shoes. <laughs> <gasps> Measuring cups! That's the last thing we need for our science experiment! We found everything! Let's head into the science lab. Come on! Hey, Trudy! Hi, Mika! Welcome back! Thank you! I think that I found all of the items I need for the science experiment! Yay! May I see them? Oh, yeah! I have safety goggles, hydrogen peroxide, Dish soap, food coloring, <laughs> yeast, and measuring cups. Congratulations, Mika. You are ready for the experiment. <gasps> wow, really? There you go. Oh, thank you so much. Uh, an official lab coat. Awesome. Enjoy. Thank you. <gasps> I'm so excited to do this experiment. Okay, everyone. Safety first. If you're doing this experiment at home, please make sure to do it with a grown-up. We are going to make elephant toothpaste. Oh, but remember, it's not really toothpaste, so please don't use it on your elephants. <laughs> the first step is we need to pour half a cup of hydrogen peroxide into this glass. Okay, and be nice and careful and pour it to the top. Okay. Step one, complete. Second, we need our dish soap. Okay, a squirt of dish soap in there. And you swirl it around, make sure it mixes a little bit together. Okay, that looks pretty good. And now, I'm going to add two of my favorite colors, purple and yellow. Okay. Get a little goop there. It looks black, but once it all mixes together, it's going to look purple. 
and yellow. And look, the yellow looks orange, but once it comes out of the cup, it's gonna look yellow. Okay. All right, next we are going to add our yeast to some warm water. And I already have some warm water right here. And you only need one teaspoon. So let me open this up and get one teaspoon of yeast. Okay. Ooh. There we go, one teaspoon, add it to the water and stir it around. See, it's all mixing together, okay. And then we're gonna add it to the glass and hopefully we will see our toothpaste in action. It's going to the top. Did you see some of the colors? Wow, it really looks like toothpaste. <laughs> oh, science is so much fun. Isn't that cool? Whoa, it's still going. Whoa, <laughs> there are the colors right there. Oh, that was so fun. Hey. Thanks for helping me find all of those items for our science experiment. You were very helpful. <laughs> science is so fun. And we had a lot of fun today, right? We went on a scavenger hunt. We did a word puzzle. Oh, I went down a really cool green slide. And there was a pretend grocery store and art. <laughs> we did a lot today. All for the love of science. <laughs> well. That's the end of this video. If you want to see more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? Cool. <gasps> Should we spell it on the planet? Science style. <laughs> Let's do it. M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> Thanks for learning with me. See you soon. <laughs> Come on, everyone.